Or mm-hmm. what it's also very good for if you want to get your um, your YouTube host wet. Oh, you're a cock! <laughs> Right out. <laughs> he did. I'm keeping it in. Oh, yes. Always. Uh, right, guys. Another little product review today. Yeah, I like these. Um, I'm having a nice little day of these. After, today. Yeah, we've done a bit of research again, didn't we? And uh, Dan from the uh, FN2 crew. Shout out, Mr. Lawrence. Mr. Lawrence uh, recommended this uh, particular part that we've got. And um, yeah, we've used it a few times already before actually doing yeah. this review on yeah, it. so we can give an honest review. Yeah, and it's actually really good, isn't it? I love you it. You love it, don't you? Like you absolutely love it. You wouldn't think it would make a difference, but go and get it. It does. It's outside still. Oh, I just used it for the previous video. Um, yeah, you wouldn't think something like this would actually make a difference. Like, it seems a bit gimmicky, but it does. It just makes, it's just easier. Well, we'll show you. He's, he's on his way. I'll give you a clue. That goes on it. Well, you don't need a fucking clue, do you? It's written in the bloody title of the video. Come on, Chrissy. Take two. <laughs> so yeah, apparently these are in like quite high demand for people. Yeah, they sell out real. Oh my god. Uh, what, uh, what's the matter with them today? Oh, we had a very good sleep last night. We were playing PlayStation. We had Darry and Beer. Hello, Captain. Pester me on and, the uh, phone. We rang, we rang him like it was twenty-eight times in total, and he's, he ended up turning his phone off. Okay. Asshole. So yeah, there it is. We didn't want to play. The quick, what is it? The quick release uh, high pressure gun from Autobrite. It's bloody brilliant. It really is, yeah. And it works great on a K2 pressure washer. Yeah, I've done that they review. do different ones, don't they? Yeah. So this one's got the K2. This comes with the Karcher connection. Do you know what I love about it as well? It's, it's these little things that make it really good. So it literally just clips straight into you the bit you take off the k2 the long fucking lance yeah you lance, do away with all that shit and that it just goes straight into the bottom of there this bit swivels so that it stops your bloody you, you all know if you're into detailing cars and washing cars pressure washing cars yes yeah, and like that sometimes because it's such a rigid up. hose it tangles up that doesn't stop it completely but it, it helps yeah. prevent it doesn't it yeah and it's just small look it's just and it's weird because when you're using it, you would think, well, oh, you're going to be close to the car, so you're going to get loads you don't need of spray to. You back. You get so much pressure from it. And you don't get. Well, this is actually. Oh, it says on there uh, do not point at human body. <laughs> Serious yeah. injury, but look at exactly. They say the pressure's on there. Oh, yeah. 280 bar. 280 bar, 4,000 psi. Yeah. So it's it's a really good bit of kit. It really is. A and good it's bit just of so kit. easy to change things, which moves it us is. on to our. To the nozzles. nozzles. Haven't done nozzles yet. Sorry, yeah. So, right, I don't know what all of these mean. Chrissy does. Well, basically... They're all different. We're going to run through them anyway and show you exactly what they do. Each nozzle has got, like, a different degree on it. So, so if you want... you've got five of these, haven't you? Yeah, but they've all got the degrees wrote on them. Oh, OK, have they? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, 40. The big no-no for car detailers, which we ain't, but anyone who buys one, do not use the red one because that, that one is just like a thin zero jet. and that is just a thin we'll jet show you it on like the floor or something obviously so you get five of them and they're all different different ones yeah different spreads of jets and yeah. obviously the smaller the spread the harsher the jet yeah yeah and all you do with them it's just got a quick like an airline it's got like an airline you, you pull back brilliant slot it in Pop. and that's it that's it so done. then you can do that on so if you wanted a slightly higher pressure under your wheel arches to get all the shit out you just switch it up and put the higher pressure nozzle on get right in it and because it's smaller you can literally get yeah all up and in so uh, and as you've already said you've got the anti-twisting on the bottom yeah it's brilliant you've got a little clip there to stop it going off if you're leaving it on the floor stop your kids fanning around with it and stuff like that yeah and on our setup as well we've got the uh the extension for the car as well yes we have which, which just makes and it, it works because you can leave your pressure that. washer in one place and, walk, walk and around the lead is, and wait, bear in mind as well that you might get more pressure from this because we're running off of an ibc tank a thousand litre water tank if you're running from mains pressure 
I'd imagine it would probably, you'd probably get more pressure from it probably, than we yeah. are. Yeah. But I mean, it, it works brilliant, it even does. off of a water tank. Completely what else do okay. we get, Chrissy? Which moves us on to the next product. Now, I was raging about this gun and wanted to and get it. And the product you put in it. Yes. And uh, I said, well, got paid and I was like to Ben, well, I've, I said to Ben, well, I've ordered the gun. And he went, well, I'll tell you what, I'll, I'll order this, the, uh, this snow foam lance. Again, auto bright as well. Um, and I've watched videos on this and the foam you get from this thing is amazing. And there's the snow foam. And you get this this as a kit with that. And also you get with the gun, this connection here, mm. which makes this a quick release. Oh, for that, yeah, for course. that. That's a sod to get off. Th yeah, that is a real pain in the ass to get off. It's so much Loctite on it, it was insanely tight. But you will need a vice. Well, you might be lucky. Sometimes I'd imagine that some are a bit looser than others, but this yeah. was, we need to device it off. With yeah, so you need, to, you need to take this off, yeah. which is just held by a pin there. And then I put that into a vice, put a set of grips. Uh, no, I didn't. I put a, I think it's a 23 mil spanner on there and then hit the, the spanner with a rubber mallet and got it to release. It was a sod, but we did watch a video. <clears> where <throat> they do even say in the video, it's very they, tight. They lock tighter because the pressure is so high running through it, they have to put lock tight on it. But it did come off. It did and then come off. Exactly the same with them. It you works. literally just. The idea is it's just, I can imagine mobile valet is going crazy for oh, stuff it's, like it's, this. It's mad, it's brilliant. You just clip it on like that. And then when you're done with it, you unclip it, put it at the side, you stick your rinse back onto your on. nozzle. It's, I'd imagine that mobile detailers and yeah. valeters and stuff like that well, would we, love well, shit like well, this. Well, we had a few. Uh, foam lances here, didn't we? Yeah, we did. We and got they two were or three. such a nightmare to get in and out with yeah. the Karcher lance. The only thing I would say is, and I, we never really did it with ours, and I think you could see the difference, was when you'd finish with it, empty your bottle and just run water for it. Yeah, just clean everything up. Just run a bit, just fill it up halfway, empty it, run the water through it, just to just to get the shit out, because they do clog up, don't they? They do. But well, the, there, is, there is another video, there's lots of videos out on YouTube about them, which I've actually done myself to one of our lances. You take it all apart, yeah. soak all the parts in bicarbonate soda and all that stuff. Yeah. What I love, it smells a bit like Marspan. Yeah. What I love about them, them is Auto Bright. I've used Auto Bright years and years ago. Again, that was because of Dan Lawrence, FN2 Crew, Southwest. Um, there's no gimmicks. No. Like, there's no fancy this, fancy that. There's no fancy freaking. This <coughs> sort of smells of fucking peach blossom on a summer's day and all that shit. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's yeah, just yeah. magic foam. Auto Bright Direct. Yeah. But obviously, the reason there's only a little bit left, well, half in there is because. Yeah, we smashed the load, didn't we? We well, actually used it on my car. Yeah, we did. And it says wash two as well. So your first wash will obviously be your rinse. Wash two will be your snow foam. And then I'd imagine that all their other bottles, which you haven't tried yet, but we will, will have wash three, wash four, wash five written on it. So it yeah. even gives you a little order. So let's get to the good bit and show you what it's like. Let's have a fucking avalanche of snow, man. Snow? Snow. Snow. I used to get called well, gnome at school. You do look like one. Connection. So yeah, Ooh, French. it's really easy. Obviously, pull that one back a little bit. French. We're in. What me? Is that it? That's it. Turn her on. She's ready to go. Sorry, mate. Yeah, he walked all the way up the other end. Mate. That end mate. I don't know. I don't know where he's gone, but. So now we're going to do a quick demo on the uh, nozzles. This is the the deadly one. The That's, red one. So this is for like gardening and shit, isn't it, really? Yeah, and also I've looked at these as well make sure that these are fully in there because if you pull that trigger that's going to fly off and hit your car yes that's a very good shot so you? make sure it's properly give it, give it a pull properly forward. clicked in that's and then it. oh my god look at that uh, come on oh, that is a, keep doing it come on that. I would say not really for cleaning cars not really if you wanted to do your arches and shit if your mm. car's in a real state so that's that one Remove that one, just like so. So that was the red one. And then the next stage is the orange one, which is a 15 degree. Ooh. Again, make sure it's clicked in nice oh, so and tight. The, so the more degrees, the less fierce it is then. Yeah, pretty yeah. much, yeah. It just looks it's like a fan, isn't it? That's right, which, yeah. uh, which is to do with these. To do with these in here, obviously. What? Got you. So that, oh, okay, yeah, so that one's... So that one, I'd imagine, is a pretty good one for giving your car first. Mm stage bit more of a yeah. stubborn that one. like your pre your pre rinse yeah this is your 25 so yep. this is... see that's more of a yeah, yeah. Wider, isn't it? yeah. which I imagine gentle that one's pretty good for 
like rinsing your foam yeah, yeah, shampoo yeah, off. Yeah. Then you've got your white one, which is a 40. This is the one we've used a lot of it. Yeah, that's like a... Yeah, that's a lot more that's gentle. More, so I would use that for maybe removing snow foam and things like yeah, that. Yeah, more of a lighter one. Otherwise, the more you jet foam, the more it's going to mm. go up in it. So that's that True. One. And then mm. this one is the absolute pointless one, I think. Oh, uh, it's good for filling buckets and stuff. It's good for you know when you you know when you fill a bucket up and you've only got your jet wash and oh, you can't be true. you can't be asked yeah, to fanny around with like you know what I mean, taking it all off and you just end up doing it and you just get suds everywhere. Suds. Ooh, this one's just a bit of a dribbler, isn't it? Yeah, this one is very very fine. So this is a good filling up your buckets with stuff. Or like what it's also very good for if you want to get your. Um, your YouTube host wet. Oh, you're a cock! <laughs> I didn't even see that coming. <laughs> you're a fucking idiot. Gotcha. I was fully, I was fully like into that. Yeah, you were, like, yeah, yeah. What a knob. <laughs> I was like, oh, what's he gonna say, dick? Your YouTube host. Very right. Weird. So, so I'm gonna use the green 25. So this is the. Make sure it's what well we'd use just for like to pre-rinse your car. And we're not gonna. Um, Clean, clean the car because it is roasting hot and never clean yeah. your car when it's boiling hot because your products will go off and stick to the bloody pink. Not having a massive, uh, just having a bit of a... We're going to just do a snow foam and a rinse for me. So as you saw in the previous video, she's been ceramic coated as well, as you can see, because the water is virtually just running off it. You see what I mean by the length? Of the actual gun itself how much easier it is yeah and, and to be honest right look how close i can stand to the car yeah exactly and i'm not getting any blowback or no mm -hmm. nothing yeah, and we all have a good blowback on us mm -hmm. get the, oh my god get under them wheel arches. this is what i like about it it's stuff like this because obviously with a normal lamp this one you're all right in there like yeah fucking brilliant i love it it's like it's great great bit of kit and it's nice and easy to use it is, mate. it's just and it's not badly priced either, what was it? 30, 39.99, I think it was. I think it was less than that, wasn't it? Okay. Or 35. Something like that. Well, all links will be in the description. I'll put a direct link to the Autobrite website as well, but I'll try and put a direct link to the gun and the snow foam, but they do sell out fast. <laughs> yeah, Jesus. very fast. I was surprised to actually get it's one. Not as fast as that. Oh my God, he's rapid, isn't he? Oh, there you go. Don't get dust on my car. So, we need to get to the good bit now, don't we? Everyone loves us. You're going to mix it up for us, Benji? Well, I did it last time and I made the ratio slightly too high. And uh, my God, it was like shaving foam. But one thing I did like about it, even though it was still thick, it was still running off. So. You get your bottle. Obviously, everyone knows how to do bloody snow foam, don't they? And... Shoe. We also noticed that on the Easy Car Care stuff that you can add your citrus pre-wash to your snow foam, which is a very good idea. We're not going to do that today. So it recommends two inches, which I did last time, and that was a lot. A lot of foam. Um, the, this is the obviously the Autobrite bottle, and it's got all your all your measurements on there, 100 mil right the way up to 1,000. So it holds a litre of snow foam, which is more than enough to do your car. Oh, was it? I did two inches last time, which I think was way too much. So we'll go. Oh, that's what it says, though. What does it say? It says two inches of product. We'll, do it. we'll just do the same again. So we put 100 mil of product in there, which is nothing, but they're only little bottles. But I think you can get bigger bottles of this. I think you can get the five litre bottles. Um, yeah, and then but we use Easy Car Care obviously a lot as well, and they do like the five litre bad boys. Then you just fill that up with water, put screw your top back on, and then we'll show you the rest. Oh, fucking drenched your prick. Oh mate, it's not as if you're not going to dry off pretty quick, is it? True. Right, put some water in them. We haven't got any in there. Fuck's sake. Oh, that's just a good show. That. Look. I don't know you could do that. I thought the water wouldn't come out. So I think better. If you want to, yeah, that's the issue, isn't it? So show me that again. So don't do it in the bottle. So without any nozzles on, that is like your tap tap power, isn't tap it? So power. that's filling your bucket. So that's perfect. So ignore what we said before. Oh, look at that. That's in trouble. Yeah. You need to fill it with a tap from a tap, really. We haven't got one. 
Yeah. We have there. Uh, and I was a bit lazy in that, really. I should have done well, I'll just go for it. Okay, right, that's right. enough for now. Screw that on. No, we haven't actually used this yet with the quick release thing. No, we haven't. Have we? The only thing I was dubious about was it swivels, obviously, because it's not a firm fixing, but I guess that won't matter, will it? Will you just wait to see this foamage? Get some nice slow mos. It's pretty mad. So that's how easy it is. Clip it on, jobs are good. Oh my god. And obviously, if anyone's used snow foam before, you know that if you twist the nozzle at the end, it's sure. Um, your fans inside open and close basically, which gives you your fan action. Look at that, How thick is that? But thick, but still pulling it off and running off. So you can see that it's clinging, it's clinging just enough, but not staying. So it's like the perfect ratio. So I think they are right, but you do, and you've got more than enough to do a whole car with it. You can see there, look, it's proper running off. It's just amazing. It's the best stuff I've used. It's brilliant, isn't it? Really, really good. And that's it, look. And that's. Two inches of that stuff, Two it's inches. done the whole car. Brilliant. Covered and the whole lot. The great thing is, is done. That's it. Take it off. Amazing, isn't it? And then you're supposed to leave it on there for about five to six minutes to dwell, to really get in on the stubborn stuff, to soften it up and drag it off, uh, and then rinse it off. But because it is like 24 degrees today, we're not going to leave it on for very long at all because then you start getting your, your water spots and your water marks, don't you, on your paint? Yeah, it's basically just to lift it off on it. Put your nozzle on. So now I've gone for the white attachment, which is the 40 degree, a bit finer. Because obviously, the more you jet this foam, especially being that thick, the more it's just gonna yeah foam up. It's gonna keep foam up. But look at it, mate. Look at the blanket on the floor. Yeah, yeah, right. It's just sick. Good stuff. It is very good. And like I said before, no gimmicks, no nothing. Just a good product. That's it, really, and that's yeah. all you want. Isn't I mean, it? I know there is one that we do want to check. It's the built hammer one, isn't it? That's yeah, one we, we want to check that out. It's supposed to be good. Yeah, we're, like I said before, we're going to do. Now the weather's been, better. Sorry to cut in. They've got two, haven't they? They've got yeah. a snow foam and a contactless wash. Yeah, that's right. So. Yeah, I want to do a lot more of these kinds of videos. I enjoy doing these, and uh, I just and you guys enjoy them. I think. So right, let's get it off with us. Don't want to leave it on too long, mate. In this weather. Obviously, the ceramic coating that we've got on there is doing its thing because it's just the water's just falling off it. I love that gun, mate. It's so good. Go on, the R. So I can. I love it. It's so easy. This is what I mean about the uh, the swivel end as well. Yeah. I mean, I, I would suggest greasing that up as well now and again. I love to reach it up the end. <laughs> it's just ace, mate. It's just it's something. It's weird, isn't it? It's like something so simple, it's yeah. but it's just really effective. It's decent. Anyway, when you're not in a rush. Especially down here, quiet, sun's out. I love it. Good car watch. Sun's out, Ben's got his guns out. Get them there. Mm. 
Look at that. This is from the polish as well. Yeah. Never used to be able to see them. Look at the blue in that. Oh my god, yeah, look at that. We never used to be able no, to see you that. Blue no, it was dead, it was wasn't it? So dead. The paint was dead. Now that blue we can clearly, clearly see it. I love it. When you were on about getting the Nighthawk black or the bronze, I'm so glad you got yeah, it. Yeah, you did say that, didn't you? I like the bronze, but there's something about that. It's so subtle. Well, it's not that in the sun. Amazing. <laughs> I really feel for Benji at the minute though because he is dying to get this these products on that one in S2K because it is fucking filthy. Yeah. Yeah. He's so excited, bless him. But I'm enjoying it's worth the wait. Car. It's worth the wait though, mate, isn't it? I'm enjoying building it and we've never done something so extreme. So extreme, no way. And I'm really liking that. But I haven't driven it, mate, since nearly January. I know. But it'll be worth it. Next year we're going to do a lot more, a lot more road trips. Definitely. A lot more shows. It'll be fun. Look forward to it. Sort out the MC500 club. Oh, you! I knew that was coming. <laughs> Differences, so I'm not going to cry about it. <laughs> No, it's decent, mate. One thing I will say, if you get an extender, we love extender. an extender. So extender <laughs> is that bit there. Thanks, so if you're flipping around your your hose and that. Yeah, that's that a great hunk of metal. Yeah. I don't think that on your bloody car. Yeah, it does. It did actually have a plastic cover on it, but it just oh, fell it off. It, yeah, it did. It just fell off. Yeah, I'll give that a quick dry and then we'll get back to you because we don't want the old water spots to appear, does this? God, honestly, this unit is like an oven, isn't it? Bloody boiling. That rear end, look. Not Chris's. Oh, I can't wait to dry FM2 video, FM2 video. It's not actually, it's a product video, so I can show what the fuck I like. Oh! It's off, look, I've done all this arch as well the other day. She's like brand new under there. What the fuck? I think I think that's a hint, don't you? Right, we're gonna dry his car off, and then we'll come back and give you our very, very honest review. Right, she's pretty much dry. We used the auto finesse drying towels, which we've had for donkey's years. We got given a load, didn't we, at the show? Yeah. I was just saying to Chris as well. You can see because we didn't ceramic coat the bonnet when we did the ceramic coat because it's coming off in a bit. And you can see the difference from just by not ceramic coating the bonnet. I mean, this is like I said. This is a rinse, a snow foam, and a rinse with a ceramic coating. And she's come up gleaming. That polish has just made such a difference. That's the Maguire's baby. It's literally a mirror. Looks great. Great, great product, that. Great product. Yeah, she's gleaming. Very nice. I can't get over how much the blue pops in it. Hard to get it around. She's yeah. definitely a fine example for an FM, I think. Yeah, you can see the blue there, look. You couldn't really see that before because the paint was so flat. But yeah. With a ceramic coat, I mean, the whole point of a ceramic coat is it's supposed to give you up to 12 months protection. The point of it, obviously, is to protect your paintwork and to make washing your car less of a chore, I guess. Yeah. And, uh, and it's that's just a rinse of snow foam. And a rinse and a dry for what half an hour. <coughs> I mean, we could spend yeah, we could spend all day cleaning a car, couldn't we? But oh god, yeah, yeah. We'll do that. Show, show that time. Was, uh, yeah, that was quick. Mm. Very good. And like we said, it, like you, well, you probably already said it. Even drying the car after yeah. it's got these products on it, it's just it just glides. It does. It's like literally like glass, isn't it? So, mm. Awesome. There we go, guys. There you go. That easy was process. The auto bright snow. Cannon, I don't know what you call it, mate. Yep, the Autobrite Snow Foam Cannon, uh, the Autobrite Magnafoam, very yeah. good stuff. 
and the quick release gun. Very good products. Amazing. Well right. done to Albright. If you wish to sponsor us, Albright, feel free. Yeah, send us some more stuff to review. <laughs> right, the only other stuff I've ever used of theirs is the Fallout wheel cleaner. Uh, yeah, you did say that. That's yeah. the only one I've ever used, and that was about four or five years ago. So, um, amazing. Good. Love it. Very, very, very good. If you're into cleaning cars, you're into detailing, or you are a detailer, not that you'd be watching this channel if you're a detailer, you might be. <laughs> um, I think it's fucking brilliant. That gun, really good stuff. the foam, as you saw by the, the video, is thick, it runs off, pulls the stuff off. Oh, it rapidly pulls off. Obviously, it. bear in mind that the car's been ceramic coated, so that's going to help massively, so it probably won't pull it off as much as it has Chris's, because that's the whole point of a ceramic coat. Yeah. But Yeah, because at the end of the day, snow foam is a yeah. pre-wash. Yeah, totally. It's a pre-wash. I give, that, I give the gun a 9 out of 10, easy. The only reason, I would give that a 10 out of 10 if it wasn't so hard to get that end off. Yeah, to, yeah. to change it over yeah because but i get why it's hard to get off because of the pressure yeah and it needs lock tight on it and stuff like that but, but just it's, all but it's right brilliant. if you're watching this video which you probably aren't but if you are um yeah make it when you make them when you construct them make them a little bit looser because if people yeah. buy the gun or what i would personally do if it was my company is i wouldn't connect either of those ends and i would let the person that buys it have the option to yeah even better put on yeah a little sachet of yeah lock tight and then you can choose what end you want on there. Let's face it, nine times out of ten, people that buy yeah, that gun yeah. are going to use of they are. that That's why you buy it. as well. So it's going to be a, they're going to they yeah. want it quick release. So but then we did, we have used the normal <clears> snowfoam <throat> cannons with it as well, which was great because I don't know if any of you have this problem, but with the cartridges and say a normal a cheaper snowfoam gun, oh, to get them in to get him in to get it turned, is an absolute asshole was theirs. It was just literally. And it's on, so it's not that much yeah. of an issue if you haven't got their gun. And it, it, and it's still working. We worth used it. it on the the, 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 the Karcher normal standard foam lens, and it, the product works just as good. Oh yeah, it did. I'm not gonna lie, it, you know, it works just the, the same. Gun, I think a gun's a gun. The gun's the more the more for convenience. Yeah, and it's and we wanted to do both of them, didn't we? So there yeah. we go. And it makes it Brilliant. more convenient for us at Carbon mm. Cardari. So Big happy thumbs days. up. Thumbs up for, for that. Auto Bright, amazing. Well done for your great <laughs> products. So there we have it. There's another video in the, the bag. bag. Thanks to Danny at Dino Days. Please go and check out all his socials: his Facebook, oh. his Instagram, his YouTube channel. He does so much for us. So make sure you They're do. They're incredible work at Dino Days. They really are. Can't They're wait to go up so and see him, mate. I oh, know, mate. I'm we so just need to get a little bit further along with yours. Yeah. And well, mine's not even drivable yet. So, uh, We've said before, yeah, we need to get it map ready, otherwise it's pretty much journey. I'm about there. as battles, as much as I'd love to, but it's a long way away for us. It's a, it's a four and a half hour drive each way. So and that'd be uh, an overnight one for me and Ben, probably. So exactly. So it's a good couple of days we're going to lose, but um, yeah. So there we go. Make sure you follow Tactical Racing, Toxic Knobs, Carbon My Ride, and we love you all. We should see. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, if you don't follow us on Facebook, oh, that'll be here. Sake. And if you don't follow us on Instagram, up here. Dick. Love you all. <laughs> See you on the next video. Peace, Peace out. Bye-bye.